Well, if you thought the smoke over the past few weeks has been especially bad here in southern Idaho, you're not wrong. Yeah, the Idaho Department of Environmental Quality says the smoke was significant compared to recent years. Our Sophia Bliss talked to the DEQ to find out where this year stands compared to previous years. Yeah, really interesting, Morgan and Brian. The smoke concentrations during the past two weeks added up to be the most significant smoke impact we've seen in the Treasure Valley in the past five to ten years. That's according to DEQ Airshed Coordinator Mike Tool. Tool also says the past two weeks, quote, we were just getting hammered from the smoke of fires burning in eastern Oregon. I also asked him about any kind of discernible trend with smoke over the past five to ten years. Tool says there's not. The data points are just a roller coaster. Every summer, even though it's wildfire season, seems to be different. If you if you took each year's kind of screen cap of what happened, especially in July, and August, it's it's kind of a roller coaster. The metric used to measure air quality is called the Air Quality Index, or AQI. DEQ takes the 24-hour average to summarize the data on a given day. In general, Tool says when we have wildfire smoke, the AQI averages out to be moderate or yellow for the day. Predominantly over the past decade, again, yellow. We've had some orange days sprinkled in there. Uh, a red here and there. Last summer in July and the summer before that, we had a bunch of yellows, but no, maybe one or two oranges. A uh, little bit of impacts later in August. Tool says there are a lot of wildfires burning right now. There are some in California, Oregon, Washington, and Canada. So depending on which way the wind blows, we have a lot of sources that we can get smoke from. So the smoke has been something very noticeable. 